Good afternoon. A man and two women have been arrested following the violent and deadly attack. Police provided an update on the investigation. Let's get to CTV's Mike Walker, who's live on scene with the latest. Mike. Well, Michelle, Nathan, at this point, it's not clear what led to this fatal stabbing at this Toronto community housing building. Investigators do say that the victim and three people now in custody are all known to one another. Now, this happened shortly after 6 this morning on the 10th floor of this apartment building at Kingston Road and Lawrence. That's where we found officers standing guard outside one unit. Now, Toronto police say when they arrived on scene, officers found a man suffering from a stab wound. They say first responders attempted life-saving measures, but the victim was pronounced dead here on scene. One man and two women were arrested, and while police say they are known to the victim, they did not disclose their relationship. Here's more from police and residents who live here who are expressing safety concerns. We believe that all parties are known to one another and there is no risk to public safety. We understand that incidents like this can cause concern for the community. And please know that we are dedicating all necessary resources for this investigation. Very disappointed. It's a pity that this thing, these things are happening. And scrupulous people are here. You understand? People that shouldn't be here. You know, and I, when, I got, when I came to this building, it wasn't like this. It wasn't like this. It was all senior because I'm a senior. I'm not, su I'm not surprised of what I heard up this morning. It, it only gets worse. It doesn't get no better here. You know? there, there's no security in the building. Now, forensic investigators arrived on scene just a short time ago. They'll begin collecting evidence in this latest homicide investigation. At this point, investigators have not released the identity of the victim and have not said what charges the three people in custody are facing. Reporting live, I'm Mike Walker. Michelle, back to you. Thank you, Mike.